Hello, star people. We're back with Kerbal Space Program, and uh, last time we left off, we tried to build a new rocket, if I remember correctly. Trying to rescue Justice, who's out there on their way to the sun, and uh, with no way back. <laughs> so we're gonna have to try and get him back. Uh, if I can find the rocket we were building... Rescue Justice. This sounds like the one I was building. Yeah, I think it was this, which is good. Let's move this up a little bit. Uh, right. Okay, so that's the center stage right there. Uh, where, what, what, how, when, why? What did we do here? Okay, we got this uh, remote control thing. We got a stabilizer wheel. And we got this rescue pod right here, which is where, if all goes well, Jester will come in and be safe and get guided back towards Earth, or Kerbin in this case. I keep calling it Earth, it isn't. <laughs> and uh, we have this science lab here. Well, it's not a lab, it's a service bay where we have a bunch of science in there. And we have this heat shield and the fuel tank for outer space action. Um. Who can say no to outer space action? Do we have any gimbal stuff we could use? Some proper engines right there? This has a lot of thrust. I don't think we need that in space. Um, skipper. Maybe we use this. It only has a two degree gimbal thing. And this is very low in... This is what I want. <clears throat> it's, it's kind of the middle thing. Okay, so maybe we use this for the center stage. But we're gonna need some other stages too. What is this? This is new. Twin bore liquid fuel engine. Okay. It has liquid fuel and oxidizer built in. What is this? Is this solid fuel? No. Okay, what is this? Let's take a look at that. Interesting. Uh, I don't think I've seen those before. They are quite expensive. 17,000 space bucks. How much is one of these fuel tanks here? 3,000. That's way more cheap. Way cheaper. Um, I, I, I don't know how I feel about this and what I'd use it for. Maybe this is a center stage thing. What's the thrust of this? Whoa, it's quite a bit actually. Does it have a gimbal? 1.5 degrees. That's... That's... Uh, I don't know what to think about that yet. So let's put that on the back burner. There, thoroughbred. Solid fuel booster. These are new, I think. I don't think we had them before, so let's go with them. Let's see here. 15... Uh, 1,500 kilonewtons, and this is a third of that, more or less. Uh, but it has a... And this has a gimbal, too. Ooh. Well, that's nice. What about the solid fuel here? 8,000? 2,600? Whoa, 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 whoa. This is gonna be awesome. Okay, we need two of them, maybe. Maybe. And get a decoupler going. Radial on the side. Uh, right around here somewhere. Okay, let's get this going. How is everybody today? Thank you for joining in. Hope you're having a great... What is it? Tuesday? <laughs> I don't know, I've been working all day and had no time to look at the clock or calendar or what and whatnot. All that good stuff. I'm finishing up an app. It's currently in the test flight beta and um, it's quite something. Right, so we need this. Okay, that doesn't work. Uh, how, what, why, when? This is even smaller. <laughs> don't I get a nice little cap I can use here? Because this isn't going to cut it. Uh, if anything, it actually helps collect the airflow right here and bounce it back even further. Um, what can I do about this? I don't think I can do anything with this. Maybe I have a tiny little fuel tank I can put on top or something? Uh, let's see here. No, this is all weird stuff we don't need. What's our thrust looking like? Okay, we're gonna do this one thing at a time. 
Let's not get distracted. Maybe I can use this adapter here. Well, that's not going to work either. Mm, all right, forget about this. We want some gimbal stuff, of course. Uh, not gimbal. What is it called? The uh, mono mono propellant for navigating in space. Are four going to be enough? We do have the space here for more, so let's go for six. And get some, uh, some of those engines, too. If I can find them, where would they be? If I was that engine, would I be in here? Uh, give me a second here, folks, as I try and find my way around what I'm looking for. There it is. Okay. Maybe those are the ones I need for going forward and backward. I don't know. I thought these would be enough, but apparently not. Let's get three of those. Uh, where can I put them so they don't intersect with anything else? That looks fine. And get three of those as well while we're at it. Okay, that's just one. Could I maybe get three of them? Okay, it won't let me for some reason. There we go, that should work. One, two, three. Nice and even in the middle. Uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see about that. I might have to adjust them. Maybe I can put them um, facing down so I can actually propel myself in some sort of direction here. But uh, for now, I'm going to move those down because they're not centered and bugs me for no good reason. Uh, that looks a little bit better. Okay, there it goes. Now. I don't have anything to cover this up, which also bugs me, but uh, it's as good as, it, as it's gonna get right now, so let's just shake it off and move on with more important stuff, like those things, the struts. So we don't wobble too much. Right, what we also uh, are gonna need here are some sort of wings, although we do have gimbal on these things, so maybe we can just get away with, uh, well, I don't know, we're gonna do the same old, same old here. But maybe we can get away with smaller ones this time around. Uh, right there. Okay, that's only two of them. Let's copy that over and get them going here as well. I just want to have them more or less on the same height here as the other one. Okay, there's only one there. No, that's, that's not going to do. Um... Well, I didn't go for three, so I might as well do that here as well. Okay, good. They look a little puny and tiny. But for now, I think it'll su suffice. Okay. Do we want some on the center stage, too? I don't know. I'm not even sure if this is going to be enough fuel to get out there. We only have this. Uh, but we'll look at that in a second here. Like I said, let's not get ahead, uh, ahead of ourselves. We're gonna do two of those here. Sweet. Okay, we might want a stabilizer for liftoff, which we're gonna attach if we can. Well, the antenna placement is kind of poopy and. Uh, screwing me over here, so let's get them over to the side, maybe. Do I still have two now? Yes, good. And now we do this. Uh, one should be fine for that. And get it right here. Okay, that looks kind of what I wanted to look like. We have the decoupler here. Let's take a look at our staging and everything now, so we can do a test burn and see how we're doing. All right, so we have, uh, this is completely wrong right there. Right off the bat, we have a wrong thing. Well, this is actually, no, it is good, but this needs to be, I screwed up. It was okay in the first place. <laughs> okay. So yeah, we're gonna do stage. What is this decoupler right there? I have 
have no idea. I want that up here too. Uh, it must be the second one. Okay, so we lift off and uh, get rid of this stabilizer. And once they burn out, we're gonna get rid of them. And then we have this center stage, and we're gonna get rid of this once we go back to Kerbin. Okay, we have these two. Uh, we might as well get those into two separate stages as well. Just uh, I have a little bit more control over what I'm doing. Let's give this a real quick save here. And uh, let's take a look at this. Okay, now, 1.54 should be good in terms of thrust here. 0 0.11, wow, those that don't do anything. Those thrusters, but we're gonna be way up there. 0 0.43, that's not good either. Uh, can I do some altitude adjustments here and see how we're doing in terms of... Okay, that doesn't change much. Okay, once we reach an altitude of 24,000, we should be able to hit that with those thrusters we have. Uh, we're at one, uh, 0.43, so... I don't know. These might not be the right, the right thing for the job. I have something better. Did I throttle them down, maybe? No. Okay, let's get rid of them for now. And get a different engine, maybe this beast of an engine right there, or this one. Let's see what it, what happens if I put that on there. Look at that, 6.18 of thrust. <laughs> it did change my staging though, I think. Let's take a look at this. Um, okay, this is wrong. Um, let's get rid of this and do... Uh, this, maybe? Get another stage going. Put those up there. Where they belong? Okay, let's take a look at this now. 1.8, which we're gonna reduce a little bit because it's not that... Hmm, doesn't need to be that high. One point four two. I think that should be good. Maybe even a little less. I don't know how much we need once we're in the the upper layer of the atmosphere here. But we'll see. Um, okay. 1.69. That's still a little high now for some reason. So let's reduce that a little bit. 5.7. That looks better. Gives us a little bit more of a uh, fuel to waste and whatnot. So let's give this a real first try here. Uh... While I figure out who I want on this mission, we used uh, Valentina recently, quite a bit actually, but she, judging from this bar here, she's still a little behind on XP, so maybe we go with her again. Alright. We have the two antenna, we have a bunch of um, solar panels, we should have a bunch of batteries in there, let's check just to make sure. Yup, there they are. Mounted to the top of the service bay. And with that, I think uh, we have everything for a first burn. Let's see how it goes. Something went wrong. I haven't even launched it. Why are we hanging off this so weirdly? Let's revert this. I think I need to lower my stage so we're standing on the bottom there. Uh, get this and move it down. Okay, that's looking better. I hate this, by the way, that we don't have anything that, to cover that up, but uh, I'd need advanced uh, building for that, or advanced construction, and I don't have it because I went all in for those new rockets and whatnot, so let's go. Real slow here for some reason. Okay, let's do a gravity turn. Have uh, Valentina keep it pro grade. Pro grade. 
lot of fuel there. Gives us some time to check out our our apparatus and whatnot. Still have a lot of fuel, which is good. Maybe we're turning it a little bit too much, are we not? Feels like we are. We're just gonna have her do her thing. Why didn't we stage? Okay. Buffed out. How far up did that get us to 25k? That's not, I may have uh, turned a little too much here. So let's try and keep this a little bit more... Uh, upwards. Okay. Already losing a bunch of fuel here. Okay. Shutting down for now. Let's just have her keep this. And let's try and extend this as much as we can, or as well as we can. If I can do it at all, I can't seem to hit the target there. Okay, let's get our periapsis to that. That's a 38 second burn. We don't want this. It is very hefty. Uses a bunch of fuel here. Feels very heavy. Okay. So we should burn a T minus 19 seconds. Let's fast forward this a little bit. Move this along. Uh, wait a second. I'm an idiot. Is there a Valentina in there? <laughs> because this is supposed to be remote co remote controlled. Okay, right. <laughs> well, we did we did good so far until I uh, discovered this one fatal flaw where I actually placed somebody in the rescue pod. Okay, so there's n nobody to be in there. Bye bye, Valentina. No XP for you. Right. Okay then. Uh, did go okay so far. I don't know what the what this was here. It was wrong. Could I please get another stage down here? Thank you. Right. So that's better. So what do we think? Uh, is this gonna reach where we are supposed to go? Or not? Might as well try again. Yes, yes, I know, something went wrong. It's always the same with this game. Something went wrong and it never tells me what. So let's see if we can set our target here. Is this who I'm rescuing? Out of there. I think that's them. Right. Don't mind these other two things, uh, they're a mission, a regular mission, and uh, we're gonna go for them at some point, but for now let's let's try this. We do have to pass the moon and uh, Minmus, or whatever that is, Minmus, yes, and try and meet up with them. So let's hope we can do that. They're pretty far away, 200, 230 million meters, <clears throat> so let's not waste any time and just lift off. So this is going to be tricky because I don't have any pilot on this now. And that means I only get rudimentary stabilization and whatnot, so it's going to be fun. Okay, we need to do our turn here. 